Speaking at a media briefing, Hobabe's mayor, Elwe Ritron, stated that housing provision is among council's key priority areas and residents are looking forward to having decent shelter over their heads. Tron adds that council allocated 15 plots to build together program to construct houses, of which 11 are nearly completed. Another 17 plots will be allocated to people who meet their requirements. Then shake dwellers, if you are in Freedom Square, you'll see the community actually wanted the media to come with us so we can go and be look also what's happening with shake dwellers. Uh, it's such a great initiative from the community side. When you look how those people are digging, it's really inspiring. And you just wish more community people can come on board and let's build together. So that place can actually have about 400 urban. That is also council has released. So it's not like nothing on the land issue has happened. There's stuff that happened. It's just because it's not happening in your community then you think nothing is happening, but in fact there's stuff happening in Hobabas. Then there's Build Together Housing Scheme. Um, there's 15 houses that were supposed to be built. I think they are busy with 11 is already standing. They are not done yet. They are at roof height. Um, right now, council is looking into a solution so we can finish the houses. Improvements have never been made to the water system to ensure consistent supply at Nozobwell and Smolingaland. However, Tron says the ever-increasing population has placed a button on service delivery. There was a challenge with Nosseville and small linger land, the water usage, um, because Nosseville is laying a little bit lower when we look from the main supply. And then every second day, Nosseville and small linger would not have water and people would complain on platforms. Now we have rectified the situation and we have done nothing. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I want to say it's how you look at things. Uh, there's water in Osseville. I've been asking people on platforms, so do, are you receiving the water? And actually what is happening here, also there's a lot of leakages underground and asbestos pipes. So council is putting as they can PVC pipes in, but it's costing so much. And where you connect these two, that's exactly where it bursts again. And that's why sometimes there's a lot of water leakages. And then these pipes are costing us millions of dollars. Um, you know, but the water solution is fixed uh, in Osseville. Tron says Council plans to bring about low-cost housing solutions, prepaid water systems, ablution facilities and income generating projects to residents of the informal settlement to help improve their living conditions. With regard to appointment of the chief executive officer, the mayor indicated that council is in the final stages of this process and an official announcement will be made in due course. Gary Kawari, NBC News, Hobabes.